And as part of our special series of reports commemorating the 10th anniversary of the September 11th attacks, we are at the ACLU offices where we're going to speak with Andres Segura about some of the civil liberties that have been lost in the pursuit of heightened security measures in the U.S. Andres Segura, thank you so much for being with us. Uh, do you think uh, that we are a safer nation today than we were 10 years ago? Um, I, I do not. I think what happened 10 years ago was incredibly tragic and it's something that we will all carry in our hearts. Um, the loss of life was something that no one could ever imagine. Um, but I don't think that we should um, give up our, our values in the name of, of security. I don't think that you, um, you, can't, you can have both. Can you give us any examples of civil liberties that have been violated since the attacks? For example, under the Patriot Act, the federal government is now able to do wiretapping without uh, first seeking a, a judicial warrant. And we believe that having the requirement that before someone is surveilled, that a, a warrant be sought first, will be able to maintain um, security while ensuring that the person who is being um, targeted for surveillance by the government um, is, is being rightly so because they are, you know, actually suspected of involvement in, in crime or potentially um, terrorism. We were talking a while ago about the politics of fear. Uh, obviously, these measures have affected all of the U.S. citizens, but it has had its particular effect on immigrants. Can you please explain to us a bit about that? Yeah, I mean, what we've always had, we've had a saying in this country since about the mid-90s of, of driving while black, and now what we're seeing is instead we're, we're seeing this uh, trend of flying while, while Muslim in which people who are Muslim or uh, appear to be Muslim or Middle Eastern are targeted unlawfully by the federal government, by local police for interrogations when they're actually not, not suspected of anything. And when you have too much information, it can actually weaken um, our, our national security. So what we should have is smarter, more focused, um, surveillance that is um, authorized um, with, with a warrant when required. Thank you very much. Appreciate your insight and your time with us today. I am Nayeli Chavez-Geller reporting from New York for Univision.